Hello, Bethel family. My name is Rob Giordano, and I want to bring you today's daily devotional. I want to first thank Pastor Michael for giving us such a great message on Sunday about the importance of thankfulness and what it means to be thankful always. But I want to take a step further and look into what it means to be thankful in all things and what it really looks like for us. See, this year has been rough on a lot of us. Many people are dealing with financial struggles, with the loss of jobs, with feeling isolated and alone, with fear, depression, anxiety, and frustration at an all-time high, with loss of loved ones even. And sometimes this all can just be overwhelming. I know it can be for me. But in the Word of God, in Philippians 4, 6-7, it says this, Don't worry about anything. Instead, pray about everything. Tell God that you what you need and thank Him for all that He has done. Then you will experience God's peace. Then you will experience God's peace, which exceeds anything we can understand. His peace will guard your hearts and minds as you live in Christ Jesus. See, for me, I went through a difficult season about 11 years ago. Uh, I had lost my, I had just lost my dad to cancer after a long and arduous uh, battle with the disease. It was a very challenging and dark time for my whole family. But in my time of heartache and anguish and loss, I chose to stop and to be thankful. Thankful for the time I had with my dad, thankful for what God showed me through my dad, and thankful for the legacy that my dad was able to leave behind. Was it easy? Absolutely not. But as I continued to go to the Lord with my pain, with my sorrow, with my frustration, as I continued to look to him for comfort, as I continued to be thankful despite the situation I was facing, I was able to find peace. The peace of God that surpasses all understanding. And from that time, as I've continued to trust in God, I've seen him use that terrible season of my life to not only strengthen me, but use it to give hope and peace to others who are going through very similar circumstances. See, there are going to be days and seasons where the last thing you're going to want to do is be thankful. But as we go to the Lord, and as we choose to still give thanks despite the circumstances, he will bring his peace to us, and he will comfort us. Brother family, I love you guys very much. I pray that you can rest in God's peace this week, and I look forward to seeing you soon.